Hi, so today I have my slope puzzle activity. Um, when you purchase my slope puzzle activity, it will come as a PDF. Um, it is a cut and paste activity where students are going to be cutting out puzzle pieces and glue them according to their slope. So you uh, will get this PDF. Um, this is the first page, the second page. You see there's an area right here where students are going to show their work and there's also an area where students are going to reflect upon what they learned from this activity. There is two pages of puzzle pieces and you will see the puzzle pieces have a letter on the top left. Uh, that is to help you for the answer key so that you can see if students um, answered or did the activity correctly. There's the second page. And then I have the answer key. So you can see the answer key. So here's a look at, um, I completed the activity so you can see how it would look. Um, it is up to you if you want students to use colored pencils or markers and make it more colorful. Also, if you want to, you can uh, print these two pages front and back so that they are not two separate pages or you can do them two separate pages and have students uh, staple it together. Um, you'll see there's also a spot where you can put this, the score so if you grade students um, it's a nice way for them to be informed how they scored on the assignment. Um, and that's pretty much it. You can see it's just a really nice clean uh, worksheet for students to um, learn the differences between uh, slope, between if you have a, a positive, negative, and also if slope is zero and slope is undefined. So it does give you the points, gives you a graph, gives you a table, and then it just gives you an equation as well. If you like this activity, I will include a link um, below this video so that you can check it out. Alright, thank you so much.